Hi there. Welcome to spending quality time with your girl, the Pussy Tone. It's been a while. We've not talked about fashion in terms of decorating our homes. It's been quite a while. But um, today, I had a few audience that had reached out to me and they have been very worried about the fact that um, everything that I've taught them that they've put in their homes has really brought a tremendous change in their environment. So they figured, how about reaching out to me to emphasize on the fact that I should not let go of my home and decor show. And I told them it's been one of those situations where I'm trying to juggle everything because my viewers are quite a number and everybody has their thing. Some people want me to talk about decoration. Some people want me to talk about hot topics. Some people are more interested in my fashion and style. So it's been quite a juggle. And I have other projects that I've started due to um, my show, Spending Quality Time with Epo Sizi Tom. I've gone into fashion and style where I'm selling closets. So um, all of that, having to juggle all of that and also my show that I'm doing the matchmaking is being quite a journey. But because I don't want to leave any of my viewers out, today I decided to come and talk about luxury fashion in terms of home decor. And you know, I've always had that love for luxury and that love for sophistication and beauty. So today I'm trying to emphasize on the idea of bringing beautiful things into your home and try to make your home very luxurious. When we talk about luxury, we're talking about excess, we're talking about abundance, we're talking about exaggeration. That's what luxury is all about. So today, this particular show, I'm trying to emphasize on the fact that, like I always say in most of my shows, money is not the question because you have cheap and discount stores out there that I've already talked about in a lot of my shows. So I'm not going to do a repetition. But if you watch my old shows, you're going to see how I've told my viewers where they can get a lot of the things to bring beauty, luxury, and sophistication into their homes. Today, I'm trying to emphasize on things like throw pillows, throws, and just nice things like candle stands and just gorgeous and beautiful exaggerated stuff and today one of the emphasis is on color i always say that i want my viewers not to be scared of color and everybody has a color that touches their heads so my color doesn't have to be your color so you have to figure what is that color that catches you that make you want to walk in and just relax that should be the color that you want to really bring into your space. Yeah, sometimes we're scared of not making a room look heavy. So if that's your concern, it's still okay. You can do an accent wall. I've always talked about accent walls because in that case, you're just bringing a particular color to create that ambience that you're looking for. So today I'm talking about little things that also bring that feeling of luxury and beauty into our homes. I'm going to talk about the magazine stand. This is a little bit heavy for me to carry, but I want my viewers to always know when I talk about something so they can know what I'm talking about. Okay, that's a magazine stand. I'm going to open it up. It's like a little basket where we have a lot of magazines. And I always like to keep magazines that pertain to that particular space. This particular space is a guest area where people relax and lounge when they're doing just fancy stuff. So I have magazines here that are more of home decor that talk about luxury and beauty. So those are the kind of magazines that I have in this area. If you can see, this one is like an L magazine. You know, I have magazines like Veranda, Architectural Digest. Those are magazines that just bring that feeling of luxury and beauty in the space. So that's what I have in this particular magazine basket. And when we talk about magazine baskets, they have all kinds, simple ones beautiful ones exaggerated ones this particular one that i showed you it's a very exaggerated one but it's like a vintage it's almost like some kind of um an antique like kind of magazine basket if you see even from the lid you can see all that exaggeration that we have on it and i have a thing for tassels because that's why i always say that in most of my shows i talk about like um something that's gonna be like something you take away from my show today i'm talking about a tassel this particular magazine basket did not come with a tassel i had to buy my own tassel and just look for an area where i could put it to create that extra beauty luxury and fashion and that's why i always say that in my luxury shows it's all about exaggeration beauty excess but when i talk about excess it's not in terms of too much spending of money 
There's another item I'm going to show you. This one is a jar that is multi-purpose, which means that you can use it whichever way you want to. I always say that your home is your space. Use it the way you want to. Use it in a way that when somebody walks in, they can feel you. They can feel your personality. I love beauty. I love exaggeration and luxury. This is one of those items that shouts luxury. Beauty. I decided to use it as a candy jar. You can tell I have a lot of candy in here. To be honest with you, I have a sweet tooth. So I'm not going to be able to help it. I'm going to have to eat one of the candies. But um, it's a candy jar. I decided to use it as a candy jar because people walk into your home. Sometimes they just want something to freshen their mouth. And if you have something like that, it's going to create you know, that feeling of welcoming. So they can jump in and put their hand in and just get the candy and enjoy. But the, particular, the main reason for me using this particular item in this particular space was to create that feeling of luxury and beauty and exaggeration. And I think I achieved that. Because like I said, it's a multi-purpose container. You can use it for different things. You can put the candle inside. You can stand it on the corner just for beauty. You can decide to put jewelry, whatever you want to put inside. You can even be a picky bank provided you have a way to close it. But I decided to use it for luxury, exaggeration, beauty. So I decided to use it as my candy jar and put it on the middle of my coffee table. So this particular segment is all about emphasizing on the idea of luxury. I am the queen of luxury. I like beauty, exaggeration, excess. So when we talk about luxury, that's what you should have in mind. Think about how you can bring exaggeration in your space, beauty, luxury, and all of that crazy. Well, I think we've learned something today because I've talked about the magazine basket, which is usually in areas that people lounge and relax. But here's the thing. I also have a magazine basket in my bathroom. That particular magazine basket is a feeling of relaxation because when I sit in my bathroom or in my um, toilet room, I just want to relax and do my thing. And with that magazine, I can just relax. And while I'm looking at it, nature's process can just keep taking place. And I can pick a thing or two while going through the magazine. So a magazine basket is a must-have in your living room, in your bathroom, anywhere that you spend a lot of time relaxing. Well, this particular show was all about fancy, was all about luxury, was all about beauty. And for my guests or my audience out there who have always wanted me to talk about luxury, this one is for you all. Because like I said, I've received a lot of calls about the whole idea of luxury and me not stopping doing shows that I talk about beauty and luxury. And I'm not going to. This is the thing. I'm out to make my viewers happy, to go with what they want. And anybody out there who watches my shows and there's a particular thing that they want me to put on my shows, I'm gonna very much appreciate if you can send me a message on Messenger, Twitter, Instagram, so I can better serve your needs. Yeah, I do appreciate those who have reached out to me about the luxury show. And like I said, this one is for you all. Well, it's always lovely spending quality time with you all. Bye for now.